think it's very nice. It's actually the first time um, I've been down this way since it's been fixed and it's no longer congested north. And it's cost around £800,000. Do you think it's worth the money? No. Um, I think £800,000 is a bit much for an area which is already not as great in terms of shopping choices as the actual high street. Do you think it's been worth the money? No, I don't think the, the time that was spent doing it, it seemed to have gone ages, hasn't it? Yeah. Well, it uh, gets away from traffic, which is, which is good. Uh, the only downside is uh, it won't keep clean very long. It'll be covered in chewing gum in no time at all. It's uh, much easier to get around, so uh, yeah, I'm quite happy. <laughs> I haven't really given it a lot of thought at the moment until it's finished and we see it all finished and maybe some greenery down here. That, that at the minute it's still looking a bit bland, but I think they're getting there. Yeah. I really don't understand the, the financial statistics of what things cost like this, but but if it's you know if it's worth it uh, to the people that use it, then yeah, it'll be it will be worth it. To improve, but I think it could have had a little bit more attractive, being made a little bit more attractive than it is. It's, yeah. it's very bland. Well, I hope it will be strong enough to take the delivery vehicles now, <laughs> this time, rather, rather than the pedest just the pedestrians, because I that was never considered before, mm. up the, the other part of the high street. Yeah. The trucks have destroyed all the pedestrian paving over the years, and they've redone it and redone it, haven't they? Because it, it was a mess before, wasn't it? And I was just looking at this on the way in big improvement. And do you think more people are going to come down here now that it's nicer? Yeah. It's lovely.